My name is Søren Turk Madsen, and I'm the project manager for GS Pharmaceutical Spray Dryers. At the show, we are presenting the latest version of our marble miner. The outer shape looks like it has been before for centuries, but we have uh, implemented quite a range of new features on, on the, the mob miner. Let us go to the top of the spray dryer first. Here at the top, we have the new sanitary two fluid nozzle, where we have omitted all gaskets, all uh, threads on this, only two pieces, one piece to the liquid to center the pipe and the outer for the atomization gas around it. Very easy and convenient to split it apart, to clean it out, and most importantly, to have a reproducible mounting again so everything is put in place. So here we see the two fluid nozzle and the drying chamber and the around it we actually have the extra feature of a nozzle protection gas that can be used especially when we are spray drying organic solvents. Around it we enter the hot process gas on this and there's also something new because up in the gas disperser a completely new design with laser cut the guide vanes have been made we started at the top, we are moving down, and you see the new lid on this. This is actually a machine part or a pressed part, so we have a very high accuracy on both the lid and the connection to the basic chamber. Another new thing is our new cyclone, our extra efficient cyclone. It has been taller and especially for small particles down to around five microns, it's extremely more efficient than the current cyclone. So in total, a completely new marble miner is being introduced. This spray dryer can be used for a wide variety of products. It can be for chemical products, it can be for food, dairy products on this, but also we have a version that is for the pharmaceutical products then we have added extra features so that we fulfill the DMP regulations for the pharma, we call it PSD1.